Hello, my darlings. It's Dion Dean. Welcome back to another video. A short video. I really wasn't planning on doing um, a Fendi video, but I got a few pieces from the Fendi outlet that I wanted to share with you guys. If you follow me on Instagram at I am Dion Dean, then I did a cute little sexy reel, <laughs> an ode to my love of Fendi. My husband actually said I probably need a Fendi shrine at this point because I have a Fendi bag there, Fendi bag here, I have these Fendi boxes, I have a Fendi big shopping bag. You know. <sighs> Some of us do Chanel, some of us do Saint Laurent. I'm actually about to start my Saint Laurent. I'm starting to Anyway, so how did this all happen? I am on the call list for my sales associate, Laura at Fendi, and I'm gonna leave her information down in the, down in the description box. Anytime they get any um, new product, new old product, right? Because it's the outlet, so they're getting pieces that are from seasons old. Um, Anytime they get things in, we you know she sends out a blast with pictures and all this kind of stuff. You guys know how I feel about my Fendi jewelry. You can see the the earrings that I got for my birthday this year. I got them in, I got them in red, and I got them in. And I'll leave a link up here somewhere. I think it's gonna be up here. I'll leave a link. Um, these are the earrings that. I got for my birthday and I believe the original was like eight fifty and I ended up or six fifty? Six fifty, then they were three twenty five and then they were having another sale. So I got these um for one seventy. I'll leave the video with all the pricing. But as you can see, one is gold, one is silver, and they're just really funky. Um and I have the, the Vuitton ones, but to be honest, I wear the Fendi ones more. And that's a big, um, what's the word I want to look for? That is all part of what I was saying. And like the brands that you like really, really are down with, you're going to wear them more. Because I wear my Vuitton ones, but not as much. I'm a Vuitton, I'm a Vuitton girl, but I'm a Fendi, I'm a Fendi girl. I am. I'm a little vulgar. Vuitton is still a little classy. I'm a little... I'm a little hood radish. Anyway, let's get into what I purchased. So these I actually didn't put on um, Instagram because I'm waiting to wear them. And I know that's going to sound crazy. Why buy it and spend that much money if you're not going to wear it? This is, I'm going to show you this in a minute. Um, let me just put it right here. Um, because I feel like I'm going to really do it up for the fall in these. I got these Fendi script socks. So this is the script this is the logo you can see it's f f f right there and then upside down f this was the last logo that carl lagerfeld excuse me whew, that carl lagerfeld um created before his past i still can't believe that he's not like he's such a force it's so weird to say before he passed away but um i kind of like my dad um but these were the last design the last logo that he um created for the brand he designed for chanel he designed for fendi um and he designed for his epimonious line carl lagerfeld and so i really wanted something with the script logo in my wardrobe because it was him of course we now have kim jones who designs for um dior men's and yeah, Dior Men's, he's now designing for Fendi Women. Um, so, you know, he's going to come up with his own, he's going to put his own stamp on the brand. But I wanted to make sure that I got those. And so the reason why I'm showing you these is because I'm waiting for the real real. <laughs> you guys know, listen, if it's not on the real real, I ain't getting it. Um, oh, I could, you know, buy it full price. But I want the Pigalle Plateau, which is the pointed toe, black pointed toe pump from... Um, Christian Louboutin. It is the pointed toe pump, but it has a little bit of a platform. It's not the Socate, which is the one that most of these girls around here wearing. I don't know how, I can't wear that. Kadisha, my girl Kadisha, she's a Socate girl. So I really want to wear it in that way. And then I got these. I don't know how I'm going to wear these yet, but I thought they were so cool. I thought they were just really cool. So I'm probably going to wear this with like a cute little pump as well. Come fall, now, I know that you're probably like, Dion, y'all don't have fall down there, so I don't know what you're talking about. But listen, I'm going to Canada, and I'm Canada. Thank you, Lord. I received that. I'm going to Chicago, <laughs> and I'm going to put this on my foot in a boot or a pump at some point. So, yeah, I just, I put them on. She showed them to me. I put them on. I was like, oh, my gosh. I kind of love that. So, I don't know how I'm going to wear it yet, but, you know, I got them. And I want to say these were 90 Here's the receipt. These were 
$110 a piece. So yeah, $110 a piece for the socks. And so then she put out the jewelry. She's like, Dion, I know you love this jewelry, girl. I know you like to stun on it with the jewelry because I'm not, I, I can't fit in the ready to wear, but I can stun on some jewelry, yo. I can always fit an earring. <laughs> so she's like, they only have a couple of these. If you want one, let me know. I'll hold it for you. And I was like, listen, as soon as I'm done with this Pilates, I'm coming up there. So this beautiful I love it. and I'm gonna keep it in that's another thing I keep my things in the boxes because for me I love to do an unboxing I feel like every time you open it and you put it on and you take it out of the little bag I love that so I keep all of my that's what my husband said I need a shrine because I keep all my boxes so oh, this is so fun. let's do this I already did it on the ground I, mean, I, I put my other necklace in here I'm not tell you why um so look at this This is the other necklace that I got. I'll put that in there. So I got the circle of the same as the earrings. I got it in the necklace version. And I'm going to tell you why. Again, this these were the last pieces from Karl Lagerfeld's last stint before he passed. Not last stint, but before he passed at Fendi. This is a moment in time. These are a moment in time because Kim Jones is going to come in and he's going to redo the logo and redo certain things for the brand. And so I just, I want to memorialize this time at Fendi because Karl Lagerfeld was there. I'm not going to lie and act like I know how long. If he was at Chanel since 83, I want to say he was at Fendi from the 70s. Sorry, Riley and my husband are arguing. So, um, I just, I'm, I'm, I don't want to say I'm obsessed, but I just, I want this like time stamped. Like I want to say I have something from when, of course I have other pieces from when he was at Fendi, but this was kind of like a special time. So let me take this out and I want to show you how I plan on wearing it and why I wanted, they're like having a good old time out there and why I got this versus because they had some other earrings and you know what you hear all this kissy loving going on you're my favorite let me see if i can close this hold on i may have to stop and start because these nails won't let me be great hold on one second okay let me move back a little bit they're out there playing and having fun riley's so excited when her dad the weekends for riley is like disney world when her dad's home she's like yeah. So they're out. You're going to hear them. Um, so the reason why I got this and why I really enjoy it is because it's long. And so I've been wanting to layer my father's necklace. This is his, well, not like this is his chain. He has had this or had this. He got it in 1974. And when I was a little girl, he used to put this over my bed so the angels would watch over me while I slept. Um, and so, yeah. Um, Hmm. Okay, so um, I wanted something that was longer than this, and so I'm wearing the the chain. And then I got this Fendi. This is another piece that I got from Fendi. I'll leave a link again to that same video. Um, but this is a Fendi chain, and you're not going to be able to see it because it's teeny, teeny, tiny. But this says Fendi on it, and so and then this is longer. So I really liked the layered look, especially where I'm wearing like an open neck blouse um some of my white numbers from um the Lorna Lux collection but I just like this because the big thing was I could never find anything that was longer than this I could definitely layer this and have something shorter um and my husband's at looking at getting me something from like Tiffany's or something something that we can pass down to Riley because of course Riley will get this when I leave when I make my transition um so just some other heirloom pieces that will be shorter but I couldn't find anything that I liked that was longer and so because I'm a Fendi gal I just thought that was just so that's how I'm going to wear it and so this was 225 and they had a white one um it was 225 as well they had some earrings again those black earrings were calling me I don't know if I'll you know because I have these in red then I have the red and then I have like the snake skin white but I don't have like black I can talk myself into anything anyway I'm gonna leave Laura's information down at the bottom you can definitely call her if you do call her let her know that you found that you got her information from me give me a shout out let them know that I'd be repping them 
I love my Cindy people. But also, I just want you to, you know, oh my gosh. How did... Get the earring, the um, not earrings, the glasses. How did I forget the glasses? Oh my god, these are the Fendi glasses. How did I forget the glasses? So these were another reason I went. Well, no, I went in there for those. And then she's like, Dion, I know you love your earrings. I'm like, Lord, please don't play with me. So she took these out. She's like, they're these are the only one. I said, Lord, I don't need no more. I don't need no more sunglasses. <sighs> I mean, how I look right now? How do I look right now? I just look like Mary J. Blige. Just too much. Just too much with the earrings. I wouldn't wear this all. I would wear this all together. I absolutely. But I wouldn't go out there with like earring this and this. These were two hundred, down from four seventy five. So needless to say, I'm going to the Miami bins. <laughs> I'm going to somebody's bins out here shopping Fendi outlet like I am Lil' Kim and Mary J. Blige. Um, but yes, so I'm going to leave Laura's information down there. And um, yeah, just let her know that you found out about Fendi outlet via me. Give me a shout out. Love you guys so much. Thank you for watching this video. Just something really cool and cute for your Sunday afternoon. Hope it blesses you. Love you guys so much. And I will be bringing you some content this week. Thank you for your patience. It's the last semester of last week of the semester. So I had some stuff to turn in and all that kind of stuff and getting Riley ready for kindergarten. Oh my God, my baby lost a tooth today. So, you know, just taking it slow, but I will be back this week with more content for you. Love you guys so much. Bye.